What is up guys, Poncho Cortez, and today I'm going to be talking about Tres Flores Brilliantine. Um, Tres Flores is a pretty old product that's been out there for quite a while. It's got heavy availability. I picked this one up at uh, Stater Brothers. And you can pretty much carry the um, any store that sells hair products is most likely going to carry this one. I can guarantee that Walmart carries this one, Stater Brothers, and a lot of other specialty hair places carry this one because of how old it is since the 1920s I believe and uh, one thing about this product though is that um, it can't hold a pompadour that's the only issue I have with it is because I tried building a pomp with it it didn't work out because it would keep on crumbling so it's perfect for a slick back if you want something that's uh, it's gonna keep it flat but deliver a high shine this is definitely the product that you're looking for the only issue though is that it has the exact same uh, hold and shine as the Murray Super Light, which is kind of an issue for me considering that the two were um, equally matched. The only difference is, is uh, application because the application with this one right here, you scoop it out. It's almost like uh, you're scooping out Vaseline because it is a oil based product and therefore it does have petroleum in it. And it's uh, about as the same as a uh, super light. Even the colors are pre are pretty much the same, so there's no difference to the products whatsoever. Although if you are blending products for uh, for shine reasons or hold, this is definitely going to be a perfect product for shine if you're going to add something to it. Other than that, though, I mean. There's nothing special about it. It uh I personally like to use it for a slick back. If it's uh if I want something that's gonna deliver a high shine, this is definitely the go to product. Only issue I have with Thrust Flores, depending on how much I apply, it could last in your hair for about three days to a week. So uh kind of a long stretch depending on how much you apply in your hair. Uh to demonstrate though how it does crumble with the pompadour. Right here. So when we start getting to this part and building it, it's gonna it crumbles very fast. So I mean, it doesn't hold it all that great. To tell you the truth. See, like right here, it can it keeps on splitting in the middle. So this is definitely one I wouldn't recommend for building a pompadour with. Other than that though, I mean personally I like using this one primarily for slick back since that is my signature hairstyle and the only hairstyle I really do. Uh, and that's all I really have to cover about this product. Definitely uh, one you should check out if you're a slick back fan. Thanks for watching and uh, check out any more videos coming soon.